Boom! What's going on you guys? Proco Taco here with the Proco Taco Show and today we're throwing it back to the beginning of the collecting season. We've got a hobby box of 1819 OPG hockey cards. This is something that I've kind of really wanted to collect this year. I don't know why, I'm kind of into it. 600 card base set. So let's go ahead and open up this entire box right now on the Proco Taco Show. The Proco Taco Show. Boom! What's going on you guys? Proco Taco here with the Proco Taco Show. And on this show we open up trading cards and share that experience with you. And so today we have this hobby box of OPG hockey cards, 1819 season with Patrick Wall on the front there. There's 24 uh, packs in this box, 10 cards per pack. And I'll just show you guys all the angles of the box there. And then of course on the bottom we have the box bottom uh, cards that you can cut out and collect as well. They're retro. We got Marshawn, Kinnan, Pedro, and David on there. So that's pretty nice. Um, so let's go ahead and open this up. Um, and actually before we get into any packs, I want to thank ZephyrEpic.com for sending us this box. Um, they have hobby boxes now you guys which is totally amazing. Um, if you want to purchase hobby boxes, OPG series, and even the other hobby products, um, I'll leave some information in the description of this video. You just got to contact them to find out the pricing and then they will send you an invoice for whatever uh, boxes you want to purchase. So let's go ahead and take out all our packs here. Okay, all 24 of them. And I like to keep the box in the background as we open up the card. So let's keep that there. We'll build two stacks. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with this OPG here. 600 card set, which is actually so cool. All right, we got Kincaid, Peugeot, an all-star of Kopitar and a marquee rookie of Oscar Lindblom of the Philadelphia Flyers. A silver border parallel of Samuel Gerard. A retro card here, all-star of Patrick Kane. A uh, Forbert, Murray, Atkinson, and Furk. Um, so OPG comes out. I believe it's actually prior to the 18-19 season commencing, so you might see some guys in old uniforms. Um, Ovechkin All-Star, Carlson, Schaller, Nash, a retro card here of Kerfoot. Retro! Nikita Zaitsev. I, I'm really digging these retro cards. They're so nice. Oh my! We hit an Aces playing card. These are so hard to pull compared to the others. And it's Connor McDavid. No way. Dude, these are so cool. I love these playing cards. This is a really cool insert that they added in recent years. And I can't believe we just pulled McDavid, the Ace of friggin' Diamonds. And the Aces are harder to pull than the other cards, like I said. Let's put that to the side for now. Uh, sharp. Markstrom and Furlins. So nice. We're off to a really good start. A really, really nice start so far. Uh, Getzlav, Morrissey, Niederreiter, Crawford, Ale Alexiak, a uh, team checklist of the LA Kings, a retro Pavel Bushnevich. A black border retro of Derek Pouliot of the Canucks. And the black border retros are actually numbered out of a hundred. So that's super super cool. And the Bushnavish was not a blank back. I gotta remember to always flip those around. Uh, Hellebuck All-Star and Karali. So like if you like inserts, this will definitely get you a lot of inserts as you've been seeing like two or three inserts per pack. There's 10 cards per pack. It's really, really nice. Julio, Barlamov, Matheson, Rantanen, uh, 
Marky rookie of Warren Fogel. Retro Dmitry Orlov. Always, always remember to flip those around. Uh, silver border of Jared McCann. Uh, Gustafson, Wingles, and a checklist 101 to 200. Um, and I've actually opened up one of these hobby boxes before. So, Bugstad, Strawman, Fnuff, uh, checklist 1 to 100. And then we got a retro checklist for the Vegas Golden Knights. And then we have these tobacco sized cards here. This one is of Steven Stamkos. And I believe you can actually hit black border parallels of these, but I can't remember if they're exclusive to the blaster boxes. Dumba, Marner, Duchesne, and Falk. Um, so like I was saying, I've opened up one of these uh, before, a hobby box, and I actually pulled this in it. I had it to the side here. A trophy winners of um, Bill Kessel, Bill Masterson. And these land like one in 937 packs, I think. Um, and I had never pulled anything out of OPG like that before. So it's a really, really cool manufactured patch. Really, really nice. But let's keep going on with this break here. Cass, Pouliot, Feligno, Schneider, and season highlights of Matthew Barzal. A retro of Scott Hartnell. A playing card, a three of clubs of Eric Stahl. Uh, DeKaiser, an all-star of Neil and Reggie. Denault, Giordano, Sevior, Leipzig, Soshnikov, Justin Hall, marquee rookie. Yuri Laterra, Silver Border, and Nicholas Halmerson, Retro Card, McGinn, and Gerard. Um, so let me know in the comments section below, guys, if you collect the OPG sets, if you're one of those people that actually build this set, because that must look so cool. Talbot, Gothis Bear, Kessler, Gibson, Season Highlights of McDavid. Oh, yes, another Black Border Retro card. This one is of Josh Morrissey. Numbered out of 100, 34 out of 100. These are so cool looking, these Black Borders. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Ethan Bear Retro Marky Rookie. Uh, Hag, Palat, and Shore. Let me just have a sip of the magic potion here. There we go. All better now. Next pack, see what we pull. Larkin, Nylander, Tchak, Hitlick, Lebrovsky, Marky Rookie of the John Gilmore. We got an Adrian Kemp Silver Border and a Martin Furk Retro Card. Um, Bertuzzi and Ellis. So I believe, uh, I could be wrong, but I believe the, the Retro, you can literally build the 600 card set in Retro Cards, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong if you guys collect this, but um, let me know in the comment section below. I believe that's the case. You can collect all 600 in Retro Variation. Watson, Dreisaitl, Voracek, Knotten, Auberg, a retro of Connor Murphy, a retro of Eric Stahl, All-Star. Then we got a playing card here, a Jack of Hearts, which is Claude Giroux, uh, Patrick, and Couture. Sutterberg, Shiri Glendening, 
Backland, a team checklist of the Blues. That was a regular uh, team checklist, and we had a little tobacco sized card of Jack Eichel all out there. You gotta be careful with those when you're opening up the packs. But Brian Little Retro for the Jets. Then we got Miller, uh, Erickson, All Star, and Rosovic. Now, last pack on that right hand side there. What will we find in here? Stepan. Sissons, Barbashev, Fiala, Cullen, Retro of Mikhail Botker, Retro Charlie McAvoy, uh, Queen of Clubs playing card Evgeny Malkin. I freaking love the look of these cards. Wow. Uh, Johnson and Saros. So let me just move these base cards over to the side so we can clear some room for more base cards. We gotta collect like 600 of them. Pasternak, Hutin, Retro Pasternak. Retro Eller. Oh, oh, another trophy winners. Frank J. Selkie Trophy of Doug Gilmore! No way! No freaking way! Wow! Wow, I don't even know what else to say here. That's... that's amazing. Wow. Okay, let's put that to the side right there beside Kessel. Wow. And then you got Kempe in there as well. Wow. You guys believing this right now? Because I'm having trouble believing it and I'm opening up the packs. Orlov, Lindholm, Sedin. A checklist of the Penguins. Uh, a retro marquee rookie of Neil Pionk. And we had a tobacco card followed here. This one is of TJ Oshi. Uh, Lindell, Connolly, Stone, and the checklist, 301 to 400. This has been a pretty awesome break so far, wow. Uh, Marlow, Placanic, Kane, Parise, a marquee rookie of Ryan Donato. Uh, Connor Brickley, Silver Border Parallel. Sidney Crosby, retro all-star. Then we got a retro Nikita Kucherov, also an all-star. <gasps> and this is why you always flip your cards around. It's a freaking blank back. No way. Oh my God. Holy crap. This break has been insane. This break has been insane, you guys. Wow. Wow. Holla and Batson. And just, oh my gosh. I don't, I don't even like, wow. It's like a hot box or something. Jeez. Montour, uh, Flurry All-Star, Sunquist, uh, Marky Rookie of Matthew Highmore. Uh, Giordano Retro for the Flames. And then we got a Clef Bomb Silver Border Parallel. Ristolainen, Brassard, VC, and Pavelski. Crap, I can't believe we hit a blank back. I don't even think it states the odds on the box. I have to check after. Um, Stahl, Forsberg. Rodin, Lad, a retro of Furlan. This, this is a retro league leaders here of Giroux. And then we got a, a little tobacco sized card of TV Teravinen. Bufflin, Line, Stasny. Alright, Hedman, Shankirk, 
Belzato, Quick, Brown, League Leaders of Barzal, a Retro Peril, very nice, Mitch Marner, Seven of Clubs, playing card, Petrie, and Theodore. Kapanen, Russell, Sutter, Frolik, Kopp, a team checklist of the Islanders, a retro Paul Beron, and a retro black border of Matt Cullen, number 2, 100. Uh, Nozin and Crosby All Star. Hey now, you're an All Star. Dubnik, Ryan, Focus, Ransa, Keller, Lewis, Travis Dermott, Marquee Rookie. Watched this guy win the Calder Club last year in person with my cousin. Really fun experience. Uh, retro Stepan, Silver Border of Bennett, uh, All Star Sagan, and the checklist 1 to 100. Seriously considering building this set right now, you guys. Like, even if it's just the regular base cards, like, wow. Um, Yossi, Sabatka, Zucker, Rask, Retro of Barchi. Uh, retro checklist for the Predators. Uh, we got a tobacco sized card here. Leon Dreisaitl. Carter, Kane, the All Star, and Barchi. We're down to three packs, you guys. Three more packs left in this epic break. Done. McElhaney. Bozak, um, Glossic, Benning, a marquee rookie of Scott Foster. Wasn't this, this was the accountant that came in for like the third period. I swear this was him, Scott Foster. That's really cool if that's actually him. I think that's him. That is him, one game played. That's really cool. This guy has a hockey card. Look at that, that's insane. That is so cool. That is so, so cool. I'm putting this one to the side on its own because it's so cool. And a silver border marquee rookie here of Anthony Sorelli for the Lightning. Then we got a retro Tanner Pearson. Monaghan and Grant. Yeah, if you guys didn't hear about that story from Chicago last year, basically they had to like call like a beer league guy in to play in an NHL game with like still a full period to go. O'Reilly, Schmidt, DeBrus, Seabrook, an all-star Boyle, a retro of Marlowe, retro Howard, gold border parallel all-star of Claude Giroux, I think that's our first gold border parallel in this break, that's pretty cool. Zuccarello and Tavares. See what I mean by you might see some guys in their old uniforms, but that's that's okay. I still appreciate this set. It's I don't know. I'm like super into collecting this set right now. Cousins, Maroon, Shifley, Delarie, a checklist for the Devils, a retro marquee rookie of Ashton Sautner. A uh, tobacco card here of John Gibson, Clifford, Huberto, and Dadunov concludes our break. So that's all 24 packs, but I hope you guys stick around for the insert recap because we pulled some pretty, pretty cool stuff in today's episode. So I'll be right back with that for you guys. Stay tuned. What's going on you guys? Welcome back for the insert recap for this 1819 OPG hobby box that we just opened up. 
and it was pretty pretty epic if you're just skipping to the insert recap i think you're gonna want to watch the entire episode once you see the stuff that we pulled in today's episode so i'm gonna start off with the silver border parallel cards we got bennett clef bomb brickley kemp latera mccann gerard and then there's a gold border there of claude Giroux. put that one right at the end Next, we'll show the marquee rookies. So, uh, Dermot, Highmore, Donato, Gilmore, Hall, Fogel, Lindblom. And this one I found so cool. Scott Foster, um, if you didn't hear about this story last season, he came in for like most of the third period in a Chicago game. Um, and he's basically like a beer league guy. He was like doing accounting throughout the day And then at night he's playing in the NHL and he actually made quite a few Saves and Chicago ended up winning that game. So it's really cool that upper deck um, Decided to create his own rookie card like really really cool um, And then there's a silver border parallel of Anthony Sorelli as well there Show these tobacco sized cards next uh, we got uh, Gibson here, John Gibson, uh, Leon Dreisaitl, Tara Vinen, TJ Oshie, Jack Eichel, and Steven Stamkos. Pretty cool. Um, next, I will show you guys some retro cards. Why not? Let's go to the retro cards. This must be a really cool set to have if you collect all of them. So let's go Howard. Marlowe, uh, Pearson, Predators Checklist, Barchi, Stepan, Baron, Baron, Furland, Giordano, Crosby, Eller, Pasternak, McAvoy, Bodker, Little, Stahl, Murphy, Furk, Halmerson, Hartnell, Golden Knights Checklist, Orlov, Bushnevish, Zaitsev, Kerfoot, and Kane. Um, along with those retros, we pulled some black border variations, which are numbered out of 100. Matt Cullen. Um, then we got Josh Morrissey and Derek Pouillot. So three of those in the box. And I'm going to show you guys, actually, let's do the marquee rookies. Also, these are also retro. Um, Ashton Sautner, Neil Pionk, and Ethan Bear. And a retro league leader of Giroux. Now, this, I really wanted to show you guys this because this is incredible. So here we have a uh, retro Nikita Kucherov. But with OPG, always turn your cards around because they might be a blank back! These are so freaking rare to pull. Um, this is the second ever blank back card I've ever pulled. I pulled one a while back at the Toronto Card Show. But this is a retro uh, of Nikita Kucherov. So it itself is an insert and then it's blank back. Um, I looked at the back of the pack to see if there are any odds. They don't even state the odds on pulling one of these. Um, so I don't know the value. If anybody collects these or knows anything about them, please do leave a comment in the comment section below. Would really appreciate that because this is a, this is a crazy pull. Um, so next we got the playing cards, which I really love that they added these past few years. We pulled Eric Stahl, Mitch Marner, Claude Giroux, Vianney Malkin, and we hit an ace. And the aces. I didn't check the odds, but I think the these others are one in five, and then the aces are uh, significantly harder to pull, so they make them more expensive if you're trying to collect them. And we pulled McDavid, the ace of diamonds. It's the first one we pulled actually, so that's that's really really cool. Really like that. And then last but not least, um, if you watched the episode, I mentioned we pulled one of these in my previous in my previous hobby box so we didn't pull this one this episode but it lands 900 every 937 packs are your odds 
And so I mentioned it, and then today, we pulled this friggin' thing. Frank J. Selke Trophy, Doug Gilmore of the Maple Leafs. Okay, the odds are the same. One in 937 packs, manufactured patch, but pretty cool. The odds are significantly like high, like we 24 packs in here, you know what I mean? Um, so pretty, pretty cool hit. Again, not too sure on the value of these manufactured cards, but if you guys know, um, definitely leave a comment in the comment section below. I'd love to hear from you guys. And that's it, my friends. That was our break today. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And I will see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching that episode. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you want to check out some more, just click one of those two squares up above. Don't forget to subscribe for more cool content. And you can always check me out on social media at Rocco Taco. Till next time, my friends. Peace out.